Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. Please continue to do so. Let's get into it, Cancer. Thank you, God, for blessing Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what is going on for Cancer. All right, let's see what's happening for Cancer. In the past was a tower, so all of a sudden something came crashing down. It didn't work out as you thought it would. It could be dealing with the Scorpio. It's like something happened all over again. Something that was already that already had residence in your relationship. It's just that you guys didn't deal with it right the, the first time. So this is what happened here with the tower card. What is the energy for now? What's going on for, with cancer now, right now? What's going on with cancer right now? Okay, the five of pentacles. The Five of Pentacles, the Magician, and the Four of Wands. So some of you feel like you're outside of a relationship, or you're not talking to. You're be, you're being ignored by maybe a masculine energy, who is not your boyfriend or girlfriend anymore. Someone who you feel like you have a really um, strong roots to, um, especially if it's a feminine energy. Someone, who, and it could be a man with feminine energy. Um, someone who you, someone, this man, you have a family with them or you lived with them at a time, or if this is a female, then it is that, um, something about being ignored, you know, not acknowledged, having thoughts of this person, but not being able to express that maybe somebody wants reunion or reconciliation. We've got a person on the outside wanting reunion or reconciliation, or this is you, Cancer. We do have Aries and Cancer showing up in the Four of Wands. All of a sudden, something breaks down. Somebody feels left out, or they feel like you know they got used, or um, yeah, somebody feels like they got used by maybe a masculine energy, you know. Um, be for money it could be for time or something like that and then there's just an energy of just feeling like okay you're ignoring me you're not giving me the time of day you're not following me you're not chasing after me and someone's trying to manifest a reunion that could be a masculine energy trying to manifest a reunion here with a feminine energy someone who they feel very um you know rooted to for whatever reason let's see what the Future energy brings the cancer. What is the future energy for cancer? So we have the hangman. So more hanging around, more waiting around for something to actually happen between the two of you. Could be dealing with a Piscean person. This also says in the near future, someone's going to be asking themselves, why am I not having, you know, the life or the whatever? Why am I not having what I really want? You know, so it's more so about reflection self-reflection perspective it's also about maybe um let me just make sure that this isn't you guys aren't going to turn into like some secret love affairs or there's also going to be somebody in the future doing a lot to be with someone you know tying themselves in knots doing this doing that waiting over here doing it just to be with someone you know let's see clarify the hangman the king of cups yeah you know be very generous uh, maybe with their love or their time or someone's really going to try to um, show someone that they're willing to make the sacrifice, the commitment. Could be you, Cancer. Could be someone you're dealing with. It's like, yeah, someone's at a place of understanding that, you know, it's kind of now or ne never. Let's see what the angel answers card. Okay. The cards want you to know there's something better. And if you believe, so for some of you, if you're in a dynamic where you are, you feel like you got used by masculine energy, that's how I feel about it. It's saying there's something better. Some of you are going after a feminine energy. It's like if you believe you can, you can actually have this relationship. Because the cards want you to know that you're ready. You're ready to either leave it or you're ready to make the commitment or the sacrifice here. 
this is what I have for you, Cancer. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you. Down in the comment section, go over to the website, book your own reading there, ask a question or two by texting your question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Come join the channel. The join button is down there. You can get ex access to the extended readings. You can also ask me a question each and every month. Uh, what else do we have going on? Come learn the Tarot with me. Classes are linked below. Um, that's what I have for you, Cancer. Many blessings to you. Take care.